Hey everyone, GoBotch here today with a brand new series and the first episode for Madden 19 on Xbox One X. This is the franchise mode for my favorite NFL team, the Dallas Cowboys. We're going to jump in here today, beginning this. This is on the EA Access. This is the 10-hour full game, but a 10-hour trial for being a part of EA Access, which is $4.99 for a month. That's what I'm doing right now. Gets you access to all the games that are on there, including this Madden 19. So I'm going to use this 10 hours, and I'm going to... Uh, start out the series for Connected Franchises. This is, again, the Dallas Cowboys, my favorite team. I'm a Dallas fan through and through. You know this from my baseball series of the Texas Rangers. It's got the Dallas Cowboys here. If I ever did hockey or football or, 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 or soccer or, or NBA, whatever, it's going to be a Dallas team. I'm a Dallas through and through fan. My season goal I've selected is to make the postseason, which has a high chance of being fired. So Jason Garrett, already uh, he's, he's got all the gear on right now. He's ready to go out there and coach, it looks like. But, uh... Everything's on the line here for this upcoming season. Game one, we are on the road at Bank of America Stadium against the Carolina Panthers. So we're going to get in there today. You look at the depth chart. you got Prescott. you got Elliott, Hearns, Williams are top two. We did have one injury through the um, I simulated preseason play. And uh, there you see Damian Wilson, our outside linebacker, is out for 30 weeks with a torn peck. Um, so that's really unfortunate to see Damian Williams being a three-year pro from Minnesota. Um, hoping he would, you know, not be hurt, but whatever. That's what happens. It's part of the game. So looking there at offense, looking pretty good defensively. Um, you got Dallas. You got Irving there, Crawford, Collins, Lawrence, Jones, Heath, Vanderreich, and Smith and Lee and Woods. So. I think we'll have a pretty good year. Again, I promise that we'll make the postseason. We're going to go in here today, and uh, we're going to do the full experience. Okay, We're going to go play. The way this series will work will be I play an episode a, a, a week at a time, and that will be how it works. So this is my first time playing Madden 19. I have not done any pre-prep uh, or anything like that. This has all just been completely fresh i started up the game i turned off the music because i don't want any copyright issues or anything which means there won't be music in game as well because they don't have a tuner where you can like turn off menu music or you can turn off in game music if there is if i'm missing that let me know because i just want to turn off the music period from the menus now if i'm in game and stuff i'm fine with stuff being in there but i want to thank you all for joining me welcome to the franchise mode for the dallas cowboys i hope you enjoy if you do please leave a thumbs up comment down below share your thoughts we're going to jump in here today. Back from disappointing seasons a year ago, as it'll be the Carolina Panthers playing host to the Dallas Cowboys. Yeah, we'll buddy. We'll be at halftime with a look at the other games that are going on. But now let's get up to Charlotte. Standing by, here are Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. Bank of America Field. EA Sports coverage of the NFL takes us to Season the opener. And Bank of America Stadium here in Uptown Charlotte. A short time ago, a scene that never failed. So we're here. We got to face Carolina and Cam Newton. Cowboys, Dak Prescott. Got to go one on one against Cam Newton here. So there's a top guy, Devin Funches. There we go. Jason Garrett getting the troops ready to go here. Week one action, franchise mode, season 2018. Cowboys wanting to rebound after a uh, letdown season and bounce back and get a battle for a division if we can. At least get to the wild card. That's the goal. So we're going up here. There you see Philadelphia lost the opening week game to Atlanta. So we're going to try to play here. I haven't played Madden in a long time, so my kicking and everything may be awful. All right, so that's short. Get him. Ah, huge hit. Oops. Hit my dog in the head with the thing. All right, so kickoff is taken back to the 32-yard line. Here comes Cam Newton leading his team onto the field. 88 overall. Not bad, 88. So we're here. We're going to get going on the defensive side of the game. We're going to do coach suggestion for just about everything we do right now. Uh, first play of the game, we're going to bring a blitz up the middle. I like to play as the D-line, typically. Uh, it may not be 
the most exciting decision, but we got the motion coming across, coming to the right side, load it. And there's a seven yard gain on first down, so not exactly the greatest first play for us defensively, but we held them at least to a seven yard gain. So here we come in, they're loading in. It looks like they're going to try to do a power, halfback power or something right here. We've got Audible. Yep, there's it up the middle. It's going to be a first down for Anderson, four yard rush on second down and short, and he moves the chains. So with that, we're going to go cover three sky, play a little zone right here. We're going to play a little bit, uh, not as aggressive on a passing down, especially right now. Middle, a run of the middle, great play there from Crawford. Gets him by a shoestring. And that's going to be a, uh, a no gainer from McCaffrey. Christian McCaffrey. Right, so now with that second down situation, we will expect some sort of gainer that they're going to try to get up the middle on us. We're going to bring an inside blitz. Go zone, see what happens here. That's long, but he makes the grab. No, stripped it out of his hands. And they'll be third down and long here for Carolina. Dallas looking to get the special teams onto the field here, and maybe we get a punt opportunity or a return opportunity. So there you see our defense coming through right there. A big strip there. It looked like a catch and a first down is now third and ten on the Carolina 43 yard line so see what we get here they're in shotgun formation Irving trying to spin can't get anything and he gets the chains over so that's going to be a first down now in the Dallas 46 yard line a third and 10 they get 12 yards and Newton hits him for a good game so now we're going to go gonna play a little bit of Smith there it is up the middle Pass and it's wide open middle of the field and Newton's hit all three right there. Three for four. It's hitting his marks. Right now I do have accelerator the accelerator clock on. I'm playing eight minute quarters on all pro. Um, that's something we're playing with. Again, this may change. I want the games to be realistic as far as score and statistics and all that. So we may have to extend it out to nine, ten minute quarters. I'm not quite sure. We'll see. Right now we're playing eight minute quarters, and there you see it's already down to four. And it's some change, so we'll see how it all works out here. Long pass through the middle, and he's going to go into the end zone touchdown. So Dallas defense lays an egg here. Cam Newton and the Carolina Panthers groove on through and just easily get a touchdown and take a 6 nothing lead. Now looking to make it 7. And they will. So 7 nothing Carolina lead on the first possession of the game. Dallas will now return and we'll try to see if this Dallas offense minus Des Bryant can keep moving and doing uh, what we think they can do. So we'll see what we got going here. Dak Prescott, Zeke Elliott. Here is Dak Prescott, third year out of Mississippi State, 82 overall. Hoping he can have a really successful year for the Cowboys, limit turnovers. He's got the help of Zeke Elliott, who's not on suspension now for this year. And uh, we're going to start things out with an inside zone run. We're going to try to get a quick run here from Zeke in between the middle of these big guys. All right, so first and 10, 25-yard line. Here we go. Zeke hit the hole, and he'll get three. It looked like three yards. So second and long now, second and seven. And we're going to go curl combo, just try to do a quick hitter to get something short over the middle of the field. Maybe some swam, because now we don't even have Jason Witten. I keep forgetting we're missing a few of those pieces, and there's Swam. Makes the catch, first down Cowboys. Zeke had Zeke over there too, but I didn't hit him. So we got the first down regardless there. One for one there, Swam with a eight yard reception. Going back run here. God, nothing, man. 
So nothing going there for Zeke. Back to the line of scrimmage, it looked like. And it's going to be second and nine. got a one-yard gainer. Again, we're trailing here. This is the first game I play, so I, I need to shake off the rest. I need to play hard here. And, and there's one at the middle to Hurts. He makes the grab, but someone got hurt. Who's hurt? Got an injury, it said. Now, who's the injured player? Don't know. Okay, well, they're not going to tell us, so. It's third and four. Prescott's in, so it's not one of my main guys. That's fine and dandy by me, so. Big spot here in third down. Opening possession for the Cowboys, and it's going to be a pick. Ill-advised pass from Dak Prescott, and, uh, I can't make the I can't do anything. So it's a 14 of them lead. Holy crap, y'all. They're not gonna allow me to shake off the rest of this, are they? First game out. We allow an opening possession touchdown. Then we throw a pick six. But it's early and we have opportunity, so we gotta see what we can get going here in the second possession. Maybe we can limit the turnovers. We need to move up this field, and that's going to be out of play. So here we go. Second possession now for the Cowboys after the pick six from Dak Prescott. Let's see if he can rebound here for the Cowboys. and uh, We'll see. It's not a good start. So here we go. That's wide open, playing that zone coverage right there. And that's going to be an easy first down and another injury timeout. So we're going to load the left side here, try to open up this side of the field for a run for Zeke to get him going for early portion of the year. And that's going to be a good run for Zeke. He's going to shrug off one defender and get across the chains. Third rush, 16 yards now for him on this day. And... And now we're going to look on this first down opportunity before we hit the two-minute mark. We're going to try to see if we can get a long pass and catch this defense off guard. So here we go. Not going to happen there. We're going to go Zeke in the middle of the field. He's going to get the first down. Sometimes it's better to be the non-risky play, and we're going to take that non-risk play up the middle. First down Cowboys here. And we're going to go back with inside zone for Zeke. Trailing 14-0 here in the early going. Opening game of the season for these Cowboys. And Zeke Elliott will be across another first down. Third straight touch for Zeke. And that is a good start, to say the least. We need Zeke to be active. We need him to be um, the primary scorer, honestly. I mean, I know he's getting a break here. we got Scarborough coming in, which I'm excited to see how this guy does. Well, there's a little spin move, another spin move. And he's going to go ahead. That's going to be a five-yard, six-yard rush. For Scarborough, it's second and four Cowboys in the red zone now at the 20 yard line. And they haven't proved to me yet that they could stop the run, so we're going to keep going through. Five rushes and five passes here in the early going. We got Austin in now for a rush, and we'll see how Austin gets right here. They're, they read the play. Austin, negative rush right there. It's going to be now third and four. And we're going to go slip screen and try to catch them sleeping here. For Zeke Elliott. Three seconds left in the quarter. Last play of the quarter, and here it is. And nothing going. Cowboys not able to get the first down. That will be end of quarter. 14 0 deficit. With that pick six and a touchdown from Cam Newton. Not a good start, but we're going to bounce back here. Try to get three in a fourth and four situation. What is happening? What is happening with my controller? Sorry, my controller's freaking out. Okay. So first play, Dan Bailey now here. Oh, my gosh, I missed. I missed. I don't know how to do kicking, evidently. I'm, I'm too early on it. So, Whatever. I gotta get good, y'all. Give me time. It's week one. First time playing it. We gotta get good. So here we go. Second defense possession for the Cowboys. Carolina up to the 14 nothing lead, and they go straight to the middle. Good God. 
We're playing like the Cowboys of last year. It's just terrible defense. Not good. Not a good start. Not a good start in the slightest. So we're trailing by two possessions right here. And another rush up the middle off his zone read. And he got it. Another push. Four carries from McCaffrey on 24 yards now. Cowboys just can't do anything really to stop him. It's second and five now here at the 50-yard line, the 49-yard line of Dallas. Dallas needing a big stop here on this second down, cause a third and short. And he's going to be third and short. I don't think he quite got there. It's third and one now for Carolina. So third and one yard. Cowboys needing a big stop here. We're going to pinch mid. Oh my gosh. Oh, he didn't get it. He didn't get that. That's short, baby. Fourth and one. We'll see what they do here. It's in kind of no man's land, but it looks like they're going to punt. So it's a win for the Cowboys here on the defensive side of the ball. In this fourth and one situation, they will punt. Will likely no return. So it's going to be out of play. Down to the 26-yard line for Carolina, and the Cowboys now will take over. And we'll look to get a score here on our third offensive possession. So far, we had a pick six and a missed field goal. This time now, we get audible out of this heavy load, and uh, we'll look to see what we get here. Bullet pass right to Swam. He makes the catch. That's a first down. Prescott is six for seven. That one incompletion was the pick six that gave Carolina the 14-0 lead. Other than that, it's been very sharp to this point. Just not been able to execute so far in the red zone, and Zeke will get another seven yards or so there. Second and short. We'll see what we can get here. Haven't gotten Beasley involved yet. We'll try to get him going. Oh boy. Don't get me. Go! Run, you fool! You shake him off, you go! So there's a sack. Dak Prescott was able to shake off the first defender, and then he couldn't get his feet going. He just stood there and got drilled. So. There's a first down catch from Williams. It's now going to be a first down now in Carolina territory. And we'll see what we can get doing here now. Moving across. Going to play the long game here and see if we can get a catch out. Playing the long ball here for Beasley. And he can't make the grab. <laughs> Big first down play trying to make a tough throw and catch, but it's not going to happen in the slightest. All right, so with that, we're going to go skinny post, try to hit somebody going up the sideline, keep the clock from moving too much. We will receive in the second half, so we need to get a score here at least in this half. Up the middle to Zeke. Zeke makes the grab, and that will be first down. First and 10 now at the 36-yard line here with the clock counting down. We're going to go halfback zone weak to the left side here. And it's going to be a short gainer. Zeke didn't get much there in the way. We haven't had a breakout play yet for Zeke other than a couple catches he's had. Other than that, that's a short gain, two yards. Let's see what we get here. And we're going to go. And why do we dive? How do you slide in the stinking game? So, clock's going to come down here. Two-minute warning. Cowboys are within striking range at the 21-yard line just outside the red zone. Needing our first score of this game, and we need Dak and this Cowboys offense to settle in and play smart football here with fresh counter downs. All right, two minutes remaining. 
here we go. First down. Put that to Beasley. Beasley gets drilled. We're going to call a quick timeout and think over the second down play. Big play here for the Cowboys now within the red zone at the 15-yard line. We'll take it, and we'll take a look here at the playbook and what they give us. So, second and four. We're going to go halfback dive, even though we'll keep the clock moving. I, uh, I think we may be able to split the gap into the middle for Zeke. On the weak side here. And Zeke does get the first down. I thought he may be able to bust through the hole there and have a good touchdown opportunity, but he was not able to do such a thing. In the middle of the field is wide open. Tough play. Fumble. No. And a turnover in the red zone. The Cowboys. How do you slide in this stupid game? Dak loses it. That's just unfortunate. We had a big gainer there. It looked like we were going to be able to finally get the red zone and a touchdown there, but it's not what happens. A minute 36 left. Cam Newton with the football. And they're going to get a big gainer here. First down, and they're not done yet. they got to go the length of the field here with very limited time, and it looks like they're going to probably play it safe. <clears throat> probably going to play it safe here. First and ten, they got fresh downs here, but Collins nothing. <laughs> I say that, but Chris McCaffrey's like, I'm a little scat back, and I'm just going to try to do whatever. So they call a timeout now, realizing that they may have an opportunity at three at least. <clears throat> Terrible first half for the Cowboys. We had a couple stops in there defensively that we needed. Offensively, we had a couple good drives that were spoiled by this field goal and then the fumble. So... Um, it's not what we've been wanting to see. There's an incomplete pass that was stripped. Second and 10 now. 39 seconds remain in the first half of the season. Next box. A huge hit there from Heath. Timeout Carolina. Third down now. The Cowboys, if they can get a stop here, we may be able to get the football back, even though the way we've been going, we probably just could take it into the into the house and not be a threatened of a turnover of any nature. Third down. Oh, Olsen makes a great play there and first down. Chains are going. The clock is moving. Oh. Not a great first half for this team. We've got to get going. And the time management stuff as well. We're not getting realistic scores. Oh my gosh, Christian McCaffrey's a freak. So just everywhere. That's the final time out now for Carolina. Eight seconds remain. We'll see if they'll take a shot here on us. We're going to bring a wild blitz on them and try to see if we can. It's going to bring man coverage, so they're going to have to hold true in man coverage now. We'll see what happens here on one-on-one -on -one coverage. Nothing there. And that's going to be it. That is the first half. So going into halftime, it is a 14-0 lead for Carolina over the Cowboys. Two Dak Prescott turnovers, one being a pick six, second being a fumble in the red zone and the missed field goal from Dan Bailey. And there you see the stats of the first half. We're winning in the rushing category. We're going to sit back and watch this halftime report. So let's take our first trip around the NFL. We'll get things started in the NFC. This is neat. So you get an inside look at everything going around. It's the Redskins who have the lead in that one. The Redskins looking to get their season off on the right foot. They've got the lead on the road. From there, we head east to Baltimore to check on the Ravens at home at MNT Bank Stadium. And they were losers so for, in this at least being the first episode, we will watch just the full halftime show just to see what it all entails. I haven't the seen the new updated stuff, so. With the road victory. Bills are looking good in week one. As we saw earlier, Philadelphia did drop their opener, which is good for us. It's very good for us. The Falcons get off to a hot start as they get the road victory in their opener. Meanwhile, in our game, it's been a back-and-forth first half. Who can put it together in the second half? For the answer, we turn it back over to our broadcast team. 
of Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. Jonathan Coachman, also commentator for WWE Raw, <laughs> pulling double duties, getting a little action Madden, which is neat for him. So we're coming back, second half we are receiving here. We'll see if we can have a tremendous first drive here and uh, get on the scoreboard as we've struggled. Two turnovers are the key things of this game. We're almost right there yardage-wise. So here we come to the line of scrimmage. First play of the second half. We're going to go Zeke. and uh, Oh, no, no, no. Keep running. Okay, got five. Fought through, got to five. We're going to go draw now up the middle. Second and five. And Zeke will make a little shimmy user juke there. That's a first down, Cowboys. Good play there from Zeke Elliott. Does a little shimmy shake, and that's a Cowboy first down. And we're going to go PA boot slide now and see if we can get something up the middle of the field. Oh, boy. Oh, no, no. Okay. The crazy ball physics are still here. Almost picked. So we're going to go slants. PA is not my thing. I'm not, I'm not a play action guru, especially with an inaccurate arm. Oh, Keekly. Get out of here, man. He read that play beautifully. Third and long now. Cowboys got to get something going here. We're going to go four verts and... See if we can get the A option to swam. Or swing, whatever his sinking name is. Third and ten Cowboys needing a big play here. Oh, oh, oh. Nothing going there for Dak. Got two on the feet. And we're going to have to go punt, so. Tough going there for the Cowboys. And I can't, I still can't time that. Whatever. Oh boy. Oh my gosh, he's juking out everybody. But he didn't get anywhere. 16 yard line. And we're going to go cover one. So a failure in our first possession of the second half. Offense is still not getting going, but we need the defense here to settle in. It'd be great to get a turnover, wouldn't it? We'll see what we can do here. Ooh, ooh boy. Here comes a run. Nothing going. That's going to be a tackle for a loss. McCaffrey shut down on first down. Now it's second and 12. Let's see what they do now here in this. Got audible left side. I'm going to go run up the middle here. And he gets the couple of yards back. And now it's a, actually just a one-yard gainer. So it's third and 11 now. Third and long for Carolina. Cowboys need a big stop here on this third down. Get the ball back with Time to chew here in the third quarter. Still have not sacked this man, and he just made an incredible play up the middle. Nobody's there on the streak. And that's a third down conversion. First down, Carolina. Cam Newton saw it and made the Cowboys pay on a streak up the middle there. Nobody's on him at all in his own coverage. Nobody picked it up at all. So bad third down play right there from the boys. There's a sack. We get it from the right side coming. Lawrence with a great sack. He's got to do a little little dancey over here to the sideline. The Cowboys love it. Coach loves it. Number 52 is freaking out over here. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right, so here we go. Second and 16, a tough play, but Newton makes it and somehow escaped that area and threw a crazy pass, but he's able to get 11 on it. It's now third and five. Terrific play there from Cam Newton, and he's been able to get out of trouble all game long. And a big part of what they've done here today. So third and five situation. Here we come. There's a slip screen, and they get it perfectly. McCaffrey has nothing but daylight in front of him. He's able to sidestep the guy, and that's going to be a 
Red zone. Going to be within the five-yard line now. At the two on the slip screen, they completely just destroyed us on that play. We'll be lucky to get this game going. I mean, right now, we don't look good. We got to get a turnover. We got to get a turnover. Make them fumble. Come on, baby. At least hold it to a field goal. At least hold them to a field goal. Let's go, Crossy. Got to hold a field goal. This Carolina team is not a slouch, man. They're not bad. You got Christian McCaffrey added into the mix now. You got Cam Newton doing his thing. You got Cuck. Uh, no, 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 no. He got to the one yard line. He almost caught that with his feet on the goal line, but he's not there. Third and one now here. Comes Cam Newton to the line. I would expect Anderson to get it. It's up the middle. Anderson's able to slip the first tackle, fighting for the yardage. So fourth and goal now. Cowboys are in the field goal situation to block this. We are able to have a huge goal line stand there for the defense. And there's the field goal we wanted. Okay, so we got the field goal for them. 17-0 lead now for Carolina. Less than a minute remains here in the opener of the second half. Cowboys need a quick score and a good stop on defense to try to get back within this game. So here we go. Cowboys got to attack. Got to play aggressive here, knowing the clock's not in their favor. Scorer is certainly not in their favor. So we haven't got the deep ball game going here for us. A tough pass over top, over to Swam. He makes the grab. And we're going to hurry it up now. 48 seconds remain in this quarter. We're going to try to try to do something huge here. To try to hit Hearns up that left side if we can. If he's double coverage, we're not going to do it. So he's not. Touch pass for Hearns. Hearns makes the grab. And he's within the red zone. A terrific play there. And the Cowboys are now on the 13-yard line. Got the two-minute offense going here, and it's working beautifully. What is happening? Trigger, trigger. Didn't work. Okay. 14-yard line. We're going to go play the stick and try to get one more play before this quarter ends. There it is. First down, at least. So end of quarter, Cowboys are working. Trailing 17-0, we're going to head into the final quarter of play in the opening game of the regular season. It's all Carolina at this point, 17-0. The Cowboys are knocking on the door here. First and goal. We're going to go halfback dive and see if Zeke Elliott can get something going here. So here we are, Zeke Elliott. On the goal line, he's going to try to answer, but he gets destroyed off the left corner. Davis came in and just completely swallowed him up. So here we go now. Touchdown, Cowboys. So there we go. First score of the game for the Cowboys. Oh, and the Cowboys are within it. They're right here battling. 17-6. to six. Let's see if we can hit the extra point. Oh, I think we got it, y'all. We did indeed. So there it is. The extra point tacked on. It is now a 17-7 to game. We're going to try to kick this out of the back of the end zone. We need a three and out. We will kick it out of the end zone. So here we go. Carolina coming to the line of scrimmage. There you see the statistics of the game so far. Not done here, but we need a three and out. We can't let them go march down the field and destroy us. And there is a quick loss of yardage right there. Second and 11. McCaffrey has been better with the uh, playing out of the backfield as far as a receiver today than he has actually rushing. So second and long here at the... Carolina, oh, he's going slip screen again. Second time they've done this, and again, they strike for gold. The slip screens again. 
And that's not what we need to do right there, y'all. Chris McCaffrey, again, he's been excellent out of the backfield as a receiver. He's done two different slip screens there, and we've had nobody to answer for it. I've not played the slip screen good at all. But we're going to get a sack there. Fumble. Cowboys gather it up, and we're in the red zone if that counts as a fumble. I'm not so sure he wasn't down. They call it a fumble on the field. Dallas covers it up. Let's look at this replay, and it's... It's arguable. I think he was down. We'll see if they'll challenge. Let's see there. What? Yeah, the ball was. He was down. So it's not going to be a fumble. They're going to definitely challenge this. Cowboys coming in here now, though. We'll see. No challenge field flag. So uh, I guess not. We could try to take advantage of this now on a first down. Ooh. Ooh, ooh. Double slant it, man. Up the middle. No, Kokely makes the great pick. What a read. I thought the blitz was coming. I saw B being wide open. A great play there. And uh, they get the ball right back. So we trade turnovers. And that may be the ball game, ladies and gentlemen. We get the play we needed. We give it right back on it. I got very excited there when I saw that the seam wide open. Oh, and a great play from Smith on a draw, on a dive lays out and uh this is this is what i would call a dagger play that pick right there and then that touch that uh that first down play he just got that's what you call a dagger play coming through huge for each other he makes that grab got an injury timeout though in the second four now so Dang it, man. I thought we were rolling. We got the play. We got the turnover we were asking for, and we just handed it right stinking back. But what a play, though, from Kukuli, or whatever his name is. I can't say that. McCaffrey, can you fumble, please, for once? Just fumble it and let us get it again. Third and two. Cowboys got to contain here and prevent any sort of big play. Third down situation. Here comes the throw, and he makes the grab. So first down conversion right there, third down conversion again. Cam Newton's been untouchable. He's 7, 18 of 20 today, 252 passing yards. Cowboys now got to scramble on defense, and uh, we, need a, we need a stop. There's a big play there. McCaffrey, again, rushing-wise, they've done nothing. It's all been through the air. It's all been Cam Newton's doing. And then the, 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 the blocking has been tremendous when they've done the slip screen. So i got to watch out for slips. Oh, the heat lays an egg right there. Had an interception, but he did not get his hands on it. There you see the stats on the day. Again, the numbers with the accelerated clock have not been true to what a real-life game would probably be. So that's something I'll, I'm thinking about changing is changing the... Time played. A big third down conversion. Third and 11. They convert once again. And we may not give ourselves a chance. So be it. Rolls out of the backfield. and I don't know how to tackle this freaking game. We heard him though, unfortunately. It's sad, but <sighs> Cowboys have probably got allowed another touchdown here. Defense isn't playing well. Offense has not been able to pull the trigger on a couple possessions, and not the opening week we asked for. Fumble! Cowboys get it back. A huge hit. McCaffrey coughs it up. And the Cowboys have the ball on their own 15-yard line. Huge hit there. Falls right into our hands. Game clip recorded. Thank you. A massive hit there. Ooh. From Smith. So here we are now. So got to go the whole field right here. And we got to do it pretty quickly. 
afford, he can ill afford a repeat of the interception that ended the last drive. Yeah, you two scores down. You take it upon yourself now to put perfect and near perfect. Why are you not blocking? Did y'all see him? Did you see the receiver upfield? He just stood there and like watched it. Instead of blocking upfield, he, he just like ran off and thought it was yeah, no big deal. So a huge play there on the slip screen. Absolutely agreed. They have to up the tempo in this case down a couple of scores. Want to make sure they have a chance to win this ball game. Flush to his right. On the run. Oh no. Okay. Well, we, we chunked it. I thought that was going to be it. I thought that was going to be really bad. Turned out it wasn't. I'm going to try to hit this option. I'm going to try to look at Jarwin, if at all possible, on this play. Second and ten. And beautiful play there. Hearns makes a huge grab for the Cowboys there. Injury timeout is in effect. A massive play on second down and long. Cowboys are in. Panther territory at the 34-yard line. And there's a short short player right there gets eight yards. What do you got? PA end around. Sometimes he gets lost in the traffic a little bit. But get him out in the open field into some space. Why, what are you doing? What is he doing? I gotta call timeout. I'm probably gonna regret calling that timeout, but. I'm not doing play actions ever again, y'all. Unless I can set it up and read it perfectly, because right now that, that animation is weird. Alright. And another pick. Why am I even. Why am I even playing it? I knew it as soon as I pressed the button. I saw him standing there. Second pick of the game. The MVP of this game. Two huge picks that have come in two huge opportunities for the Cowboys in the red zone. And uh, that's it right there. That's the ball game. I gotta run out this clock. Okay, I can't tackle. He just ran out of bounds, plain and simple. He did it for us. Second and six. Dang it, man. So disheartening. Pick! It's a pick six! The Cowboys aren't done yet, ladies and gentlemen. Cam Newton, a big error. And the Cowboys pick six, 30 yard return from Jones. It's now a 17 to 13 game. Cowboys can get it with any field goal with a made point after attempt here. We'll see. And we will knock it down. And we are right there, ladies and gentlemen. We are within it. Now the question is with 219 remaining. Do we go onside? I don't think we do. I think we kick. We have time. We have two timeouts and a uh, two-minute warning timeout. So with those three different stoppages, we can get a three and out if we hold. We've got a hold here, though. We're going to go fire free, bring the blitz, and hope to the Lord above that we can maybe jar ball, ball loose. Oh, man. And there is a grab. What is he doing? Got to go timeout. Everybody stood still and watched it. Three-yard gainer. Go cover one. Oh, boy, y'all. Crazy week one game here. Trailing 17-0. We're within a score now. Again, the clock is not in our favor in the slightest. But we are here now in a big spot. It is now third down and eight for the Cowboys. We have one timeout remaining and a two-minute warning as well. So we'll see if we can go in here. Third and long, and that's, that's it. Man-to-man -man coverage didn't work out for us in the slightest, and they're going to be able to, I believe, just run this thing out now. 
We have one timeout remaining. We get one more stoppage, but I don't think there's enough time using the player clock there. They get 40 seconds, I believe. So, we got to jar the ball loose here on this play. Just don't get it. Timeout. So, on this next play, if they don't just go take a knee, they may go victory on us. We'll just do victory formation. We'll see. Again, I don't know with the time permitting in game left, if they can run it out by taking the knee. It looks like they're going to run a play here. Second down and 11. We've got a jar of ball loose here. And we can't tackle him. He's able to get it. Third and five now. So a third and five. Minute 20 left in this game. We're going to get the ball back if we can hold this and not allow first down. We'll see what they do here. So we, we, we keep them from a first down. We will get the ball back with a change order of uh, time left. So it's going to be less than 20 seconds, about about 25 seconds left. When we get this ball back to go the length of the field to get within field goal range with zero timeouts remaining. A very shallow punt. <laughs> Uh, you hit me. That should be a penalty. He touched me, y'all. Y'all saw that. So 26 seconds remain, Cowboys. <sighs> we got to reach into our bag of tricks here. Alright. Big time. Let's go. No! Stay on your feet! Didn't get it. We gotta make a throw here. Come on, baby. Get to the line. We got two plays left in us. Maybe. Freaking set. Uh. And we threw a pick. That's it, y'all. That's it. We fought hard, but we couldn't get it. Well, we fought hard. We we're down 17-0, like I said once again. 17-0 deficit. Fought back to 14-17 deficit. We we're only down by three. But it's five turnovers. And that's the difference. I mean, you can't turn over the ball that much, especially in two spots in the red zone. Uh, defensively, we, got, we can't allow those big plays on third down like we did. And uh, honestly, that was that was the big difference here today. So, 17-14 loss. Cam Newton outplayed Dak Prescott. Look at the completion percentage: 84.6, 314 yards, and a touchdown. So, 0-1 now on the year. We're right there with the Philadelphia Eagles at the end of Week One, and not the start we were hoping for, but. It's just week one, ladies and gentlemen. It's, I mean, we're going to be able to play a lot of football. Um, we'll see what comes out of all of it. Yes, just do the upgrades, like I said. All right, so week one loss. We're going to advance ahead now to the second week of the year. We've got the New York Giants. Yeah, let's look now at... The standings right now, the Redskins are the sole team ahead. They are 1-0 through the first week. The rest of the teams in the NFC East are 0-1. So, again, it's not how it planned out. If you were to tell me the Redskins would be the leading 0-1-0, I probably wouldn't believe you. But uh, it's early. It's a new season. Things, Crazy, crazy things can happen. We have the Giants coming to AT&T Stadium for the home opener for the Cowboys coming up in the next episode for Madden 19 on Xbox One X, the connected franchise for the Dallas Cowboys. If you did enjoy today's video, even though it was a loss, if you did enjoy it, please make sure to comment down below, share your thoughts, voice your opinions, help me out. If there's any tips you can give me, please do share. I'm not a prolific Madden player, uh, so I, any tips would be appreciated if there's certain plays out of the playbook, uh, schemes, whatever it may be. I'm all ears. I'm welcome. Uh, all uh, any help I can get so please share that thought your thoughts down below if you did enjoy it leave a huge thumbs up for me and feel free to subscribe here go watch gaming help me reach my goal of 200 subscribers but 
I hope you all enjoyed it. It was a lot of fun. I will be bringing you a couple more episodes of this before my trial does run out. After the trial runs out, no guarantee that I'll have more, but we'll see um, just what happens with Madden 19. But I have enjoyed it so far. It was a good first game, even though we lost, battled back, only lost by three. We're right there at the very end. But thank you all for watching. You all have a great rest of your day. And I'll see you all in the next video. Y'all take it easy.